to my jurisdiction. <laughs> Welcome back to pause mode Welcome and the back. final episode of Die Hard Trilogy. Are you typing out? Yeah. This is it. He's tapped it. out so he doesn't have to focus much on the game anymore. Yeah, this is the finale of the game where I fucking went on a rampage. So let's go into it. How did you feel about Die Hard 1 in the Die Hard trilogy? It's a rampaging rampage of a game. <laughs> but it's just like, it's difficult. And it's, but it's like, it's the same, at the same time, it's staging that arcade style. Sorry, excuse me. Sorry, you're doing a retrospective. Excuse me. <laughs> Sorry. So what would you say? Would I have a good time to save you. Die. <laughs> what would you say were the good parts? Oh, uh, whole game. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like obviously it's difficult. It is difficult because as you can see, it's without knowledge of item placement, you don't necessarily get very far. And I remember where certain things are, but like at the same time, I don't remember much. <laughs> it's one of those games where you get better at through trial and error. Um, compared to a lot of like games like this, though. Like, you know, where, where it's like the camera's stuck behind you in a very fixed position. Yeah. As we mentioned earlier, the way that it deals with the wall, as you can see right now, the fact that you can see through the wall, so you don't have to worry about it. I mean, he can't see through walls. But that's by, that's by the by. But it's like, you know, it, things phase out to accommodate the camera, and all games can do that. I'm not saying this is a perfect game. I mean, you know, I... It's I mean, a fun game. It's a fun game. It's not one, it's not like, you know, Got the most amazing. Well, it's it certainly doesn't go into. It doesn't have the most amazing story because it doesn't rip the movie straight away, <laughs> and it, there isn't really a proper story to it because you, you face a lot of very unfaithful to the movie villains, all of whom are all of whom are labeled boss. Yeah, <laughs> and think that you're like an, an American. El Jefe. El Jefe. What were the bad parts of the game? Uh, bad parts of the game. Bad parts of the game. Um, the weapon system, it's not the best. You know, like you get a gun, you chew through it, that's it. But if you like accidentally pick up another weapon, you know, on the side, you lose that one. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. Because I'm sure that I've had weapons and lost them. Oh, I died. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Robocop flashbacks. I can't really, you can't really say much about the graphics because obviously it was it's, it's, it's very much standard fare for the PlayStation at that time, but I'd say that like the way that the character models are done are quite clear. Yeah. Also, this is actually really high quality graphics for the PlayStation. It's pretty ludicrous. Here. Oh yeah. Um, this is a uh, harsh. This is overkill. <laughs> Literal overkill. Yeah. Um, I feel like. I feel like. You didn't if, get if, on the board. Yeah. I feel like if they wanted you to get through the game, it wouldn't necessarily be easier. I think it'd just be a case of they would give you more, not more live, more continues. A, a, a continue system would go away to at least allowing you to finish the game. Yeah. But because of the fact that they're going for the, the uh, this arcade style system, kind of forgive it. Do yeah. You know what I mean, it's, it's just it's, it's it's meant to be played in short bursts. Uh, this burst went off for a hell of a lot longer because we were having so much fucking fun. Yeah. <laughs> uh, especially, I mean, that was outside of the game fun. The game was facilitating it, though. Oh, you've got to do, this has got to be the one where you fuck up and just let the bomb explode. Oh, absolutely. I have to do it. I have to do it. It's, well, it won't be a fuck up on my end. I'll be doing it deliberately. It'll be a fuck up on John's end. It'll be all his fault. See ya! <laughs> He misses the door. Damn it! <laughs> Damn it! He just gets unceremoniously gunned down. Damn it! <laughs> that guy gave up. He's just like, well, he's rolling everywhere. I can't stop him. They see me rolling. They hate him. Oh, they're trying to catch me very dirty. Very <laughs> dirty. They're trying to catch my vest. Very dirty. <laughs> I don't know who this voice actor is for, for him as well. Like, it's so, like... That is a question I want to know who did the voices for this game because Jesus Christ, you provided we were so much fun over the time that I owned this game in the past and now that I'm playing it again. Uh, uh, presume it would be mentioned somewhere. Uh, wow. Oh, that's another thing about the game. The fucking destruction of when you, when you literally like, destroy things, yeah. it looks so good. Like fucking blowing up a car just then looks amazing. Blowing up everything, like glass, as I said, the like blowing up glass looks awesome. 
Um, get him! I really would like it to have stayed at least, you know, like have German terrorists rather than just bland American ones. The Germans are at the top. Oh, right. No, that's not true at all. Oh. <laughs> you had me going. But the, it's, then again, the death screams. Oh, no! And the fact that if you have certain weapons, you can chain the death screams as well. Ah, ah, ah! That's pretty cool. Like There's nothing about the voice axes in here. I'm not surprised. It, well, it was, it's hardly like it was the era of like high quality voice acting, so like they weren't necessarily gone named. There's maybe. actually another part to this Die Hard thing that I didn't read out, so I'll read this on it. Really? They're intelligent, highly trained, and they kill without remorse. They're a team of vicious international terrorists that lost their demands on them, hundreds of innocent lives will be lost. Buses have been taken, explosives set, now for the glass. Now from the glass and steel labyrinth of Makatomi Flight, Plaza High Rise, to the crowded terminal to Washington, or slash Doula's Airport, to the mean streets of New York City, time has ticked down the seconds until the bombs detonate, creating an inferno of twisted wreckage and handled bodies. Bullet point one, the situation looks hopeless. Bullet point two, except for one factor the terrorists never planned on, Detective John McLean. Oh, right. A cop with the determination of a pit bull. Well, actually, in the third one, they planned for it. And the but bad, it still doesn't work, but still. And the bad habit of always being in the wrong place at the wrong time. It's up to you to help McLean wipe out the terrorists, find and free the hostages, and defuse the bombs before it's too late. You'll need brain, skill, and a little help from some of the most deadly weapons a cold-blooded terrorist or hero cop ever laid hands on. Speaking not of deadly mention, weapons. Not to mention the guts to take on the impossible odds and come out on top or die trying. Speaking of dying trying, where's the bomb? I need to find the bomb. Where is the bomb? Here we go. We climb up there. Maybe it's in that van. Tried the van though. Maybe it's you need to double check. Oh shit, I didn't get the hostages! Guys! Guys! This is the wrong room! <laughs> Guys, there's a big four on my screen, what does it mean? Oh, Two, God. one, and what happens with the DOLIC! <laughs> God, that would explode his all. Straight up fucking explodes outwards. Yeah. Wipes out everybody. The tower should have just crumbled into itself. Oh yeah, the terrorists would have lost. The terrorists just straight up lose when that happens because the entire tower comes down. They never accounted for that. Yeah, they're just like, yeah, we'll blow up the building. Wait a minute, won't we be in the building? No, it's just hands and he thinks, he thinks he's really smart. like, blow up the bomb. Take him down. Wait! <laughs> Wait. And it zooms into his face. Oh, I forgot how to throw grenades. I don't have any grenades! <laughs> but, <laughs> I have no lives left! Because I don't have any grenades. Whoops. Whoopsie daisy. <laughs> this isn't going to be a good run. Would you recommend Die Hard 1, this game, to anybody else? Absolutely. You want to fucking challenge yourself? Go out there, try and get the high score. Can you do better than Al Power? Can you high score? Can you score higher than our power? Can you score? Can you score? Can you do it? Can you do it? Can you become the man of power? The man of steel? Oh, I uh, found another way to die. Hang on. <laughs> our power. I'm gonna check to see oh, something. Man. I'm gonna check to see if there's any, uh... Any what? Any cheat codes. Of course there are cheat codes. Let's see. How do you think I completed the game in the first place when I got it? I cheated. Let's, let's... There's level skip codes, I know that. There's so many codes. <laughs> oh no, I don't think I saved any of the hostages. <laughs> oh no, they're like... This, this is this will be the first time we were actually mess around with this. So, Die Hard 1. Uh, Absolutely Die Hard 1. Yeah. Do you have to go to... Do you have to exit the game to use them? I think that's what you have to do. It just looks as if you just do it in the game. Oh. Oh. Options? No, it's just, uh, you're pressing buttons on your control. Oh. So yeah, just go into Die Hard 1. Okay, I'll go back into it. Cool. There it is. It's still new. Left and right changes game, but we're going back in. We're going back into Die Hard for the last time. To explode right. everything in our path. Freaking adverts. <laughs> I hate adverts. It's alright. Well, there's probably a guy that I love adverts. Click on this, get a tin of beans. <laughs> it depends on what the advert is. Some adverts are. Fun yeah, to it doesn't watch. specify where you need to press these, so I'm just going to assume you can do it in the level. Okay, so go on then. 
so your first one, if you just go into the level right now. Okay. While paused. So yeah, you're definitely in it. Yeah, while paused. Okay, let me just uh, pause the game. Right, square, square, down. Right, square, square, down. I did it. Continue. What was that? Do it again. What was that? Do it again. What's the Do it again. I don't think I actually There we go. Right, square, square, down. Yeah. I did it. Continue. Okay. Oh, maybe you meant to, because you're pressing up as well, aren't you? Can you press can you press star and then go down to quit and then press star? Oh, again? Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Oh, we're cheating. Yeah. Just Fine. just go in there. Press start and then right square square down, then press start again. No, I did right down down. <laughs> right, square square down. Start. I did it. What did that do? It's meant to give you it's meant to activate the fat mode. Okay. Fat mode is. Well, because you would have made him fat. Try it again. Right, square square down, start. Hmm, hard to tell. Maybe that's makes my dark. What other codes are there? Uh, while well, paused. Oh, that might be why. Why? While well, well paused. Yeah. So yeah, just go to pause. Yep. Hold R2. Hold R2. Right square square down. Right square square down. That did it. That did it! That did it! Fat man incoming! Well, the both of the stone in the suits on the plane which is the terminal! John, you look as if you're gonna have one too many cheeseburgers! Not enough! <laughs> Bring me a cheeseburger around. Oh god, they're all fat! <laughs> what the fuck did these guys take over the tower? How the fuck did you get in there, John? I think it's all water as well. Oh god, I should land on it. Urgh! Uh, pause the game. Yep. <laughs> Hold down R2. Yep. Right, up, down, down, square, right. Right, up, down, down, square, right. Okay, now you've got him. For a shotgun! <laughs> <laughs> that lunk wandering around with a shotgun mowing down everything inside. Okay, press that. Hold down R2. Yeah. Right up, down, square. Right up, down, square. Right, now you're invincible. Oh boy. Oh boy, here we go. Okay. Fair, there's only invincible, let yourself get shot. This is what we find out. <laughs> That's one way to find out. Have uh... you got one for grenades? Uh, press, <laughs> press, yeah, uh, press that. Alright. Hold down R2. Yep. Uh, right square down circle. Right square down circle. There, now you've got 50 grenades. Oh shit! Get the hell out of here! <laughs> okay. He didn't get out of here in time! Are, are you ready for your next one? <laughs> this is great. Oh, are you ready for your next yeah, one? Shoot them. Go for it. Uh, hold down R2. Yeah. Uh, down square triangle down. Down square triangle down. Okay. What have you done? Kill someone. They find them. They find someone that can. There are two different types of codes for this one, so this one, that one might not have been right. We're about to find out. There's two hostages here, it's fine. Here we go. Ah! Oh, he's too fat, he can't get through the other I don't know, you do. <laughs> oh my! <laughs> That's not the one I was expecting. Okay. But okay, you've got floating depth. You've got the other one on. Uh, so press start. Okay. You want to press triangle ten times and then left four three, times. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four. Go five, on. Six, seven, no, no, no. You've five. already done it. So it was just triangle ten times, left four times. But you should have activated it because you did that enough time. Maybe not. Press start again. <laughs> yeah. So triangle ten times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four. There you go. Yeah. go it's not doing the thing. It's not doing the thing that. Does you should end the level? No. Uh. Well. Find out on the next level what that did. <laughs> or if, or if it even works, because like it, unlike the other ones, it didn't just like immediately come back to the game. It doesn't come back to the game when you use that code. Oh. Did the others do that? Yeah, the others, like, when you press square, take you back out again. Alright, fair enough, then it probably didn't work. It was meant to activate something called skeleton mode. Maybe it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, square. 
No. <laughs> That's fine. Uh, okay, so press start. Just wait a sec, I need to bring a new meaning to the word fat, into the phrase fat rolling. Who oh, knows? I didn't know there was a phrase in the first place called fat rolling. There is. It's a, it's, it's a Dark Souls thing where basically like, you, you got a build where you like a tank and you roll everywhere because you're high stamina. You ready? Yes. Uh, so hold on your R2. Yep. Circle, circle, square, square, right. Circle, circle, square, square, right. What did that do? I don't so know. It, it activated something, didn't it? Yeah, yeah, I did. Uh, scream when shot. So you need to get shot. Okay. I think it's giving you now do their scream. Ah. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, okay. You ready for this one? Yes. So this one is a uh, down, circle, circle, down, triangle, down. Down, circle, circle, down, triangle, down. This is called silly mode. Okay. Maybe all these codes are clashing. <laughs> Hard to tell. Fuck something with my heart. Oh. Okay. I presume if you put in the fat mode code again, it might disable it. Maybe. Nine. Oh no, he's dancing. Uh, he's dancing. He is dancing. It's through the night. They're all doing it, I think. Oh, well, he's dead. That's <laughs> 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 the most insane way I'm gonna kill them. <laughs> Happy trails. See you in heaven. Oh, he was about to. They're afraid of me. Oh, they're shooting between the legs! <laughs> <laughs> it took me a couple of seconds! <laughs> they're shooting between the legs! Oh, now they're about to die. <laughs> oh, man. Any more? There's, there's, a uh, Press start. Yep. And then it's... Uh... R2? Right... No, sorry. Hang on. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Yeah, R2. Always R2. Yep. Circle, circle, square, square, right. Go find a plan. Go find a what? A plant. A plant. Hmm. Time for a challenge. I don't know where you can find a plant there, actually. I think you found the one that, that silly one, which was kind of like into the ground or whatever. Yeah. Is it this one? Ooh. Might not be this one. Might be. Yes, to die. Hi. So, what have you done with the plant? Uh, the screen now. Oh boy. It's green. Don't think there are any plants on this level. It's green. Find them though. Find a plant. What else have you got? Up your sleeves. <laughs> I just about to uh, find a plant first, but could take a while. Uh, the only other codes I've got here, I've got display coordinates. Uh-huh. Uh, level skip. Oh man. I remember I actually used level skip. That's pretty much it, they're the only two codes I've not given Yeah. There are other codes for other, for other die hard games in this as well. Yeah. Because you can give yourself invincibility and uh, maximum specials and Fergus mode in Die Hard 2. Fergus mode? Fat mode again. Map header. Oh, wow! A map header? Skeleton mode, odd shaped people. Die Hard 3's got car floats in the air, right. chase view, infinite lives, infinite super. Oh god. Everything is flat. Oh what? Fat mode, Fergus mode, fuzzy dice in car. What is this obsession with Fergus mode? Odd mode, sky cam mode, slow motion, and very slow motion. Oh my word. God. It's time for this old guy to kill some people. Invincible. It's time for this old dog to learn some new tricks. Here he comes. Big trick time. Here we go. Trick. Nine. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> oh, <yeah>. <laughs> Jesus Christ, John, you're fat out of me. <laughs> that, did, that doesn't take much slimline. Happy meals! <laughs> <laughs> this episode brought to you by McDonald's. <laughs> and I thought you hated appetizing. <laughs> Happy truth. Happy truth. Oh, you could complete the game like this, but it just would not be in the spirit. 
It wouldn't, no. I might do it as a bonus lot, though. Oh, yeah. Just show just, people just the ending. Okay, running around. Do it invincible and just like it through again. Does the game even have a proper ending? That's why we do it. Find the proper ending. Oh. Yeah. Just run through, just run through the game invincible style and just kill everyone. True. <laughs> <laughs> You're free now. Free to die. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess uh, you, you, should, you should just let the bomb explode. Oh, yeah. That's absolutely. the end of the series. If the bomb just explodes. Absolutely. I do wonder what that's going to do to the game because I'm invincible. It probably cuts the controller and just loses life. It's probably the only way you can die. Well, we'll find out soon enough because there's only one guy left. Where are you, little piggy? I'd like to show you the happiest of trails. Come on, show yourself. Come out to the hallway, have a few bullets. Would you like a Brucey bonus, son? Hmm? Is that what you'd like? Is that a bonus you're looking for, or are you just happy to see me? Because he floats into the sky. Here's the one. Can we make it? There it is. I can make it. So, Merry Christmas to everybody out there. And have, have a good one. Have a good one, enjoy your New Year's. Christmas Unless you don't believe in Christmas. At which point, fuck you. I hope you've enjoyed yourselves <laughs> really as much as we've enjoyed ourselves today. Oh, we'll yeah. go watch some Planet Earth and probably get some food or something. Yeah. Um, really right. Six, five, four. Merry Christmas! All the fucking <laughs> Merry <great>. Christmas! <laughs> we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.